hi. So I was checking up my psych engine first tutorial, and it blew up. Now the video has 3000 views. So I was scrolling down, to read all of the comments and a lot of it about an error messages they get. It is my fault, because I'm not teaching it properly. So I decided to make a video about how to fix all of these error messages, but I'm not going to answer all of it. So let's get into the video. Project point XML not found. If you got this error message saying project point XML file, or specify another valid project file, it may be happen, because you are not running lime test windows command in your psych engine folder directory. To fix this, you have to go to your psych engine source code folder and copy the directory path. After that, go into your command prompt and type cd then space and paste your directory path there. Then press enter, and run lime test windows and everything should work perfectly fine. Haxlab is not recognized as a command. For this problem, you would have to paste these commands into the command prompt. But you would also have to paste a different JIT path for every commands. Here is an example. For the JIT paths and the commands, I will put it in the description. After you did all of the commands, Try to type in Lime test windows, and it should work. Could not find hacks on a blink widget. For this problem, you would have to paste this command into the command prompt and run it. I'm not sure if this will work or not. Hackslab is not recognized. You can solve this problem by uninstalling hacks and installing it back. But make sure the version is 4.1.5. I'll have the link in the description. Lime is not recognized. This problem has two solutions. The first solution is to run Haxalib run Lime setup command in the command prompt. The second solution is for people who had already run Haxalib run Lime setup, but it still doesn't work. The second solution is by typing in Haxalib remove Lime and type in Haxalib install Lime. This is a Psych Engine new version bug. You can fix this problem by going to main menu state.hx and go to the 237th line and remove this.